Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris, the newbie tutorial redux. I'm your host Colors Fade, it's episode 19. It's the year 2454. And we're and we're just prepping for the end game, really. I have most of these planets up here are taken care of. I have one ring world. It's doing Research really well. Complete. The research now is just on almost every part of it. It's just the little bonuses is all. So just researching all that stuff. That's, that's all that's left. Is to research all the bonuses. Construction complete. And uh, there's this fallen empire here, the 001 caretakers. Fleet power is now compared is inferior compared to ours. We're, re we're really waiting Research for that. complete. The end game crisis, trying to figure out what it's going to be, when it's going to happen. Finishing out the last few worlds here. I'm being passive and not deciding to try to like finish off the Raxar commissariat or anything like that. In part because everybody likes me now. I'm friendly with everybody. I feel like the 001 continuity would be something to go after, but we don't have a relationship with them at all. It's still a question mark, which I find really weird. Probably because they're a gestalt confident, co gestalt consciousness. And it says, uh, it is our duty to look after the organic civilizations of the galaxy, Bioforge Masters. Already, far too many have fallen victim to era data block corrupted, like attacks, so we don't know who that is. So they're ancient caretakers. I assume that that means that they're here to help, and when the end game crisis happens, they're going to be here to make sure everything's cool. So, that's where we're at. Just kind of floating along. I'm trying to get all my numbers positive again. And, uh, there's not much more to it than that. It's a waiting game now. And trying to finish off some of my planets here. Anti-crime campaign. We can end that. Let's see. This planet's getting closer and closer to being done as well. A few more specialist jobs there. Culture worker jobs. Container jobs. Oh, here we go. Upgrade that. Get some more. This planet's getting close to being done. This one's getting there. It still has a lot of districts left for housing, so this can keep going full upgrade. But in order to do that, we're going to have to be able to put crystals down and things like that elsewhere. And in this case, these first two research buildings are provide two jobs each. So what I would probably do is upgrade this one and then replace that second one something that I'm going to fall short of. These require gas when they upgrade, but gas has been when, oh, well, actually finally starting to fall short on gas. So I'm going to upgrade this one and replace this with exotic gases. So then the math on that is uh, by upgrading these two buildings, you provide three more jobs, taking care of the two jobs, specialist jobs you're going to lose for each one of these. And then you get two new jobs because of each of these buildings. So it's a net gain in jobs, it's a net gain in research. These guys get lifted up. Everybody's happy, and you get more secondary resources. This planet trying to get to 75. It's got one unemployed person. Ooh, done with. Maxed out food. Let's sell that. Let's take a look at this plan. We can provide another Research job complete. here. By doing this. Just grabbing shield hit points. Try to Research make complete. Our fleets as powerful as possible. Leader lifespan. Construction complete. Edict duration, army health, army damage, those kinds of things. Sign up. 
Right, just gained a trait. Really need to take a look at my trade stuff. quarters of the ship here. Because a lot of this stuff isn't necessary anymore. Construction complete. Like, what is this? This is trade being collected from there. Yeah, I guess it is still kind of necessary. It's just necessary in a different way. I don't need many of the trade protection rounds. That's the thing. Rimrock. Research complete. So. Shipyard. Let's see. What do we have here? Planet build speed, defense, platform, damage. That's what I would like. Construction complete. Really should start setting up some more automated trades now. So let's do this. Um, I'm going to sell a bunch of these. Sell like that much. That let's do. Let's buy some things. Let's buy um, gases. Let's buy like how many gases do we want to buy? I think that might be too much. We're gonna find out. All right, we we're gonna see how big of a chunk that takes. Cause here, for a hundred, it's a thousand. Yeah. So. Construction complete. Do that to add new monthly trade for crystals. If we bought a thousand, a hundred crystals, that'll take a thousand off. We can sell more food. Add that. And sell more of this. So if we do that, it's still good. This is still good. There we go. Now we're down to 1k, so it's not going to grow as fast. These numbers shrink. Obviously. I don't like to automatically sell these yet. That'll slow things down so we don't have to mess with it quite as often. This planet unlocked its 75th person, its last slot. So let's give it a job. Um, exotic gases. How did exotic gases go up to... Oh, because of the, <laughs> the amount we're buying. Durr. Okay. Well. That's funny. Oh, no, and see, now we're in the negative. Okay. Now we're hemorrhaging money. Because the, these, these are too complete. big, aren't they? These values are too big. Let's see how that works out. Okay, worker unemployment. Construction complete. You guys are getting close to needing to be shut down in your growth. Not quite you guys yet. This is a research complete. Right, more army damage, great. Army health. Either lifespan, administration, capacity, just grabbing all these things. Closer and closer to being maxed out, and we'll do like we did on this one and turn off its turn off its growth. Construction complete. Have so much money now that we can safely buy extras of these to keep ourselves 
in the black. So I think what I'm going to do is adjust these numbers a little bit. Add a new monthly trade for construction boats. complete. Do something like that. And then I'm just not going to feel bad about just upgrading these to provide jobs. And we'll get our, get our world set up. Galaxy set up that way. What do we have here? You guys got some pirates. Gotta take care of those. Because I ain't giving you my fleets to do it with. All my fleets are pretty much upgraded. Um, so let's take a look at that. <coughs> Excuse me, what is this got to do here? Hydroponics base, sure, ground. Um, so the first wave is here. It is fully upgraded. This one needs, this is the second wave, and it needs a couple more battleships, obviously. So do that. The third wave is fully upgraded. These guys are fully upgraded. These guys are fully upgraded. The pirate is fully And this is the sixth star order. Where are these bozos at? Just over here, doing their thing. Okay. They're pirate suppressing, I guess. They're like pirate too. A spell. They're like our second group of pirate hunters. I don't think they're as necessary anymore because now we have this going straight over via a gateway. Construction complete. So we're just waiting for the unbidden or whoever to show up. These guys are Research almost 100 complete. fleet now. Let's see. Hit points. Construction complete. We've got our Dyson Sphere here in Rint. Construction Bacoon. complete. It's a... Uh, Construction built complete. Piece by piece. Actually, was there another ring world that I could build? You know what? I think I can build two of those now because of... Uh, I think I can build two things at a time now because of my... I can't build a ring world around a black hole, can I? I doubt it. But there's a matter decompressor. What if you do build mega structure? Construction yeah, complete. Okay. <laughs> well, let's look at uh, what else we want to build then. Ships upgraded. Construction so complete. What else can we build? We can build some stuff. I think I can. I have an edict going on. This architectural renaissance. Mega structure build capacity plus one. So I can build on something other than the Dyson Sphere right now. Research complete. So building the Dyson Sphere, let's look at like maybe putting together one of those other specialty things. Yeah. So here you are. So let's look at building a mega structure like Research complete. The Strategic Coordinator Center, National Starbase Center, augmenting defensive and offensive capabilities. Sentry array. Gradually expanding sensor range, eventually covering the entire galaxy. I kind of like that. The idea of that. You have to build it on something. Building sentry array site. All right. Construction complete. Build it there then. That'll be cool. Construction complete. I like the sounds of that. Let's see what he does there then. Yeah, I'll build it right here. Very cool. That bit of business. Go look, one of these planets way up here. This, yeah, you guys are pretty much done. Are you You're getting there?
Construction complete. What else do we have for edicts? That would be cool. This is scientific re revolution, scientific research speed, 20%. How much does these cost? It costs 154,000, and how much do we have banked? We have, oh, we have a lot. We have like five times that banked. So, will to power, monthly influence, the grand fleet, naval capacity plus 20%, ship upkeep minus 20%. I'm going to do that. Is that switches that over. Construction complete. The minerals, hearts and minds, fortress proper command, starbase upgrade speed. Let's, I don't need that yet. Desperate measures, I don't need that. A defense war and scientific revolution. I could use that. Might as well use that and, and make our 5% research bonuses go just a little bit faster. And same thing with the, we've got this, so we could use the research grants. We do that. We'll just make all this little, all this bit of research here just go Construction a little bit faster. A little bit faster. The year is twenty four fifty nine. Man. Construction the announcement complete. of the endgame crisis has to be imminent. It's got to be soon. They're not going to give us just like 10 or 20 years to handle the crisis. As far as uh, the Elgate clusters in the region, we don't have access to. As far as victory goes, we're uh, clearly in first place. So we're... And in fact, uh, three of the other factions have stormed ahead of, uh, of the fallen empire, the protectorates as they are. And we have excess construction of complete. So we can sell some of it. I wish I could get another one of these, because these are the ones I like having. Technological Ascendancy, Flesh is Weak, Grasp the Void, Galactic Force Projection. In order to get the Planet Killer one, I would have had to give up something else. And uh, I guess the thing to give up would have been Grasp the Void, probably, in order to get that last one that I wanted that had the Colossus on it, the Planet Killer weapons. So I'll have to take a look at that when the game's over. I'm going to I'm gonna do this, take a look at all of this stuff and kind of write it down and keep it in mind for future games that, because uh, I really did want that Colossus, the Planet Killer weapons. I've done that before and it's a lot of fun. Quite a bit of fun, so. This generator world, yes, you are running out of construction. That's going to provide seven more jobs. Ten, it's going to provide three more jobs. So this can be replaced with something else. So I'm going to replace it with moats, and then I'm going to do this. Decisions. Siege robot assembler. Clear pockets. Or you're done. This planet has not a lot of housing left unless we want to switch some of this over. I think we do. So let's do this. Let's do that because it doesn't have a generator district on it anyway. So let's take this and replace it with three cities. Get these guys. This planet's running out of housing. And it still has enough space for a few more jobs. So if we take this and replace it with luxury housing, we can upgrade this and we'll do the same thing here. Seems for what I'm going to clear You're done. This planet is getting to be done.
Incoming transmission. Okay, what do we have here? Research complete. Diplomat. Oh, they want to give us energy credits and minerals. Well, Raxar, we'll take that from you. They're just trying to kiss our butts, that's all. Um, edict duration. Yeah. Research complete. Armor, hit points. Minerals from jobs. All that stuff. might crank this up to the next fastest to the fastest and we'll see if we can get to the end game crisis construction or at least get it started get the end game crisis started and let's keep taking a look but star bases are done shipyards are done this is a pirate fleet it needs to be upgraded so we'll do that reinforced fleet might as well do that ships upgraded So this, it, I I need to know where that, where the uh, end game crisis is going to come from. That's the thing. Where is it actually going to come from? These this pirate fleet here, pirate hunters too. Let's add a bunch of battleships to it and get it kind of ready. Construction complete. And maybe a couple point defense cruisers. Research complete. Let's see, that's almost construction complete. It's almost more than we can handle that. I don't want to cough up my number here, even though it doesn't mean anything right now. So we have more than enough money to handle it. Shield. Construction complete. Construction complete. Research is at 16k. Well, that's pretty cool. That is pretty... Subspace Echoes, here we go. Alright. Several of our tracking stations have picked up a pe peculiar subspace echoes coming from somewhere in intergalactic space. The echoes are faint, but getting stronger, and they seem to be approaching our galaxy. A storm is on the horizon. It begins the coming storm. Situation Event log updated. Chain. Okay. Coming storm. Mysterious cluster. Here we are about to receive visitors. All right, where are they coming from? That's what I want to know. Do you know where they're coming from yet? Nope. Okay. Well, approaching the outer rim, the strange subspace echoes we detected in intergalactic space are now approaching the outer rim of our galaxy. Several smaller contacts appear to be racing ahead of the main body of echoes toward a number of rim systems enter these positions into this situation. situation log updated track all on map oh they're right there okay gentlemen start your engines oh man you need to be down here fast get to rent Biku. um where is everybody where's all my floats it's not panic they are in our systems though that stinks all right first wave <laughs> Second wave. Third wave. You guys are headed there. Gateway, Gate Warden Fleet, get there. Pirate Hunters. Okay. You guys are gonna need to kind of band together. So I'll tell you what. Head over to Bioforge Prime. Same thing with you guys. Bioforge Prime, I got a job for you. Start making ships. Let's not wait. Just 
start making battle ships I don't care how expensive it gets. Let's just start cranking them out. Oh, and then, uh, let's see, edicts. Crystalline sensors, exotic gases for fuel, exotic gases for shield boost, volatile ammunition, volatile explosives, volatile reactive armor, focusing crystals for energy weapon damage. Let's see, capacity overload for energy credits. Desperate measures, ship build speed in a defensive war, home territory fire rate. And Starbase upgrade speed, defense platform build speed. Might take that as well. Okay, oh, and that architectural renaissance, oh, I still want that one. Hearts and minds, monthly minerals, will to power. Let's see. And then how's our defense platform here looking? 23 and 23. Rent Bikun, it's four, it's worth 47.9k, so here it comes, and let's see. The closest station we have is right there. I'm gonna start doing this. I want shipbuilding stations as close as I can get. For upgrades and repairs and just everything. Uh, this, even if I upgrade that, it doesn't really matter. So we'll have to resettle those people later. Get our ships over here. That's the most important thing. <laughs> Get our ships over here. Uh, We've got two choke points, but I want everybody to show up in Rint Bikun first. We're going to see how this plays out. I'm not sure which system is going to be the most important for them to Construction be Construction complete. We have a science vessel right there. That may not be the best spot for them to be. Research complete. Construction complete. Edict duration, army damage, army health. We need longer edicts, that's what we need for sure. Construction complete. We're going where? Yep, everybody, the smaller fleets meet up at Bioforge. We're building big, huge battleships as fast as we can there. We don't have time to retrofit everybody to whatever defenses are coming through here. Whatever offense is coming through here. Coming storm. Okay. Crisis. In-game crisis is what we've complete. been waiting for. Right? Armor, hit points, kinetic weapon, attack speed. I got a bunch of fleets right there. So. Buckle up, Buttercup. Crime boss. Okay, you guys. Shipyards, crew quarters. Actually, let's go. Let's just do that first. Because if we have to, we can move people and try to hold the line here and here. We're gonna find out how that's gonna work. You guys can all join hands. All be one fleet. Construction complete. The crisis. I figured it would take place in our system, wouldn't it? Not our, not our messy neighbor systems. <laughs> That's all right, though. This is all right. There's nothing wrong with this. Um, these guys are going to keep spitting out. Yep. 
just keep spitting them out. There we go. That used up a bunch of those. Cool. Just keep building that fleet right there. Waiting is the hardest part. Where are all my fleets? You're there? Okay. You're there as well. Awesome. Um, in fact, I think what I might do with you is choke point you there. Sentry array construction. The light of sun blinds and the darkness of the void hides. Only when we learn to travel faster than light did we learn just how little the light reveals. Today, we begin to end this amorosis of ours. The sentry array we were prepared to build in Bioforge system will one day become a stalwart pen whatever that word is. <laughs> it's so give up on that word right away. Oh, and I don't have... Okay, I gotta wait. I gotta wait till I acquire some more of that. Oh, well, we're about to max out our money, so let's do this real easy. Let's buy some. Let's just buy it. Uh, Sentry Array Sight. Let's get to work on that. This thing right here, what is this? This starbase needs uh, resource silence. Did we do that? Do crew quarters. And then um, I got an, I got a plan for you. This is the other thing. Let's do subspace signal. Establish the visual speed. The visual speed. Incoming transmission. Okay. Main screen off. They're ugly. Um, what do we have here? What is this? This is a trade hub thing. I'm not worried about it being a trade hub anymore. Let's give me a defense grid supercomputer. They're gonna show up. They're gonna show up, and we're gonna be as ready for them as we can be. Ready to store. As soon as this fleet is done maxing out at 250, we'll fly Research it over here. complete. Energy weapon attack speed. So let's see, do we have a particles person? I don't think we do, but let's check. Nope, no particles person and no particles person to recruit, so you get the job. Who has open jobs? Okay, what, I'm going to resell somebody here to somewhere where there's open jobs. Ringworld, at B. There you go. What about you? Construction complete. Okay. Hostile. The first wave. We have received word that several outlying systems along the Galactic Rim are being overrun by some sort of invasion force. This appears to have been the source of the subspace echoes we detected approaching our galaxy. What we are encountering now is only the Vanguard. The main body of contacts has yet to arrive. Alright, well, here we are. 22, 22, 22 against that. And there's these guys here. Rust. How big are they? Okay. And how big are they? 22, 22, 22. They're not that big. Okay. In that case, here's what we're going to do. Gate Warden Fleet, go take these fools out. Main Vanguard. The 
Yes, you fool, so we're not moving. Aggressive stance, aggressive stance, aggressive stance. Get in here. Mining station yeah, lost. Oh, Spaceport under here? attack. Oh no. What are you guys doing? Yeah, crush them. What do they look like? They have hull points, armor, no shields. So, no shields, and their stuff do damage to shields. We may, we may be okay with our default setup. So we've kind of skewed heavily in that direction. Okay, you took care of them. Go down there. Hostile station engaged. Hey, I have a to trade. That was quick. Go there. We have once again gained control of the Mura system and rebuilt at our outpost in orbit around the star. That's what I'm talking about. Head back there. End of the scourge! That was it! The galaxy breathed a collective sigh of relief today as the last significant pockets of the Prithorian scourge were expunged to their extra galactic invasion has failed, and all that remains of the Prithorians' once colossal swarm are the innumerable charred husks that now drift quietly through the void. A sense of elation and utter joy is spreading across the galaxy with speed greater than light, and spontaneous victory celebrations have erupted on countless worlds. Could this be the beginning of a new age of galactic peace and stability? Their organic technology was most intriguing. Gained a bunch of unity from that. Happiness for 20 months. Ends the scourge. Well... That's what we get for being prepared. Man. Hot dog. Okay. Guys, geez. Well, everybody, um, return. Repair. Repair thyselves, and uh, we'll send you back home. Where you need to go. Wow, guys. Jeez. Good job. That's about the quickest crisis I've ever had. Research complete. So that's what you get for being prepared. If you if you get ahead of those guys early, the scourge, then uh, they're not so bad. <laughs> that's what I remember. I remember the first time I did that, I didn't get a hold of them, and man, they just swarmed over the galaxy really fast and trying to squish them back down to their home system that they come out of and and conquer them there. Those first complete. fleets that come out with, like they said, are just the vanguard, and those were twenty two thousand fleets. They start coming out with hundred k, hundred fifty k fleets shortly after that, and and if you if you don't squash them early, then they're done. So that's one of the types of end game crisis you can get. That's not there. There are several different kinds. I think the scourge are pretty easy, like you just saw. If you Research complete. if you're prepared and you're ready and you get on them early, it's uh, it wasn't that bad. So so at this point in time, let's do this. Let's get our science ship out here. And uh, where is our science ship? Right there. So what you can do is this. Go research that project, research that project, research that project, and research that project. And that will give us some tech. This is, that was fantastic. First wave, you're repaired. You can go back to where you were. You are not repaired. Aggressive stance. What are you doing? You're not repaired. Who needs repairs? It says you need repairs. Oh, no, it doesn't. Okay, great. Third wave. You're repaired. Go home. You guys are repaired. Go home. Gate Warden Fleet. You're repaired. Um, where do I want you to be? It says your home base is Vertimon Station, but that's a, not a good place for you to be. Let's put you at Rint Bikun. Construction complete. Rint. Rint Bikun.
Construction complete. Debris analyzed. Is that not what it's called? Is Rint Beacon Station? What do we call this? Partial Dyson Sphere. This is Gateway Station. Okay, so you're the Gateway guys. You need to go to the Gateway Station. Assign you to that base. You can go right there. Wow. I'm stunned. That was kind of cool. It's kind of cool that we got ahead of it and, and it was over. So now I can just put it on the fastest speed and uh, we've got 36 years to kill. 36 years to kill, so uh, Construction do we want to complete. take on the Fallen Empire? Do we want to squash them? That might be kind of cool. We may have to do that. We may have to do that next episode. Debris analyzed. certainly liked all of that that was just that was trippy fun all right we're, we're building structures building makes the second wave. what we're annoyable no longer able to discern the main body of approaching subspace echoes from our own galaxy's background radiation which can only mean one thing they arrived. I this I, I believe is a bug in the game um, that the whole they arrive thing after you've already defeated them and then you'll hear that little crackling sound so, Research complete. This is a bug from killing them too quickly, uh, is my understanding. Because I've had this happen to myself before. So, unfortunately, now the scourge, the scourge sound plays the whole time in the background. So here you go, paradox. I've got it on complete. video. The scourge bug that happens. I killed them quickly, and then. Uh, this is what happened. So, the L cluster. You know what we could do? We could go after the L cluster. Um, what would it take for them to give it to me? Zorkon Black Hole from the Rifari High Kingdom. Let's construction complete. The Zorkon construction Black complete. Hole. What are you doing? Are you building anything over here? Build that. And then build that. Uh, Zorakon. Construction okay, the complete. They, they like us a lot, but I want that. We can trade you. I want Zorakon. What kind of system would I have to give you? Bagel. I'm not giving you Bagel. Diskidia. What would, it, what would it take to give up to get that from him? Because this is this stuff up here. Debris bagel, skidia, blah, 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 blah. What if I gave him? What if I gave him all this stuff up around here, like around Heesh? Zorkon. Let's see about this. <laughs> I wonder why it picks those particular sites. Like what? Research complete. How much? I give him all this stuff, and he's like, no, not. Nah. Doesn't want to trade away any planets. So that's too bad. I can't. We'd have to take it by force. That's too bad. I don't want to take it by force. I just want you to give it to me. Because it's a... We don't have control of the L gate. Well, we could go to war for it. Construction complete. How fast would a war have to be for us to just get it? Research complete. I wonder. Scourge missile. Debris analyzed. Um, let's do this. What do we need for claims? OK, 
Okay, let's put our fleets in position to go do that really quickly. And also to be in a defensive posture for when they're inevitably going to attack us. Like, where's that one go? Right there. So I need someone at Sidor. I need you at North Wormhold Station. Debris analyzed. Research complete. Because I want to know about the Elgate thing. I want to know. They've got a black hole there too, which is the most awesome thing. So right here they've got a natural worm soul that contains an unexplored natural worm hole. Wow. Sentry hub assembled. Great. Sentry hub. So since the swarm was not a big deal, let's make ourselves have a big deal here. Let's make ourselves do that. You guys won't give it to us, we'll take it. So I need, there's a wormhole there, and then this wormhole is right there. Okay, at a dashik. So, so this one goes where? Right there, this is zero zero one continent. This one goes right there. Perfect. What are you doing? You're just sitting there. Go up to bag all then. We'll do this ourselves. Ourselves. Let's go see if we can get that Elgate thing. Oh, and here we have this group here. Pirate Hunters, assign a leader. Great. We're in really good position, aren't we? Okay. Oh, yeah. Turn that on. Research complete. Transport fleets. Yep. Administrative capacity eating duration. All right. See what they got for fleets? Not much. All right. Rufari High Kingdom. <coughs> Declare war. We must end our Federation Association status before we can declare war on them. Oh, really? Okay. Construction complete. We can revoke their association status with our Federation. Construction complete. Yes. Research complete. Vote to revoke the Rifari High Kingdom's association status with the Gold Pact Construction failed. Construction <laughs> complete. Unknown signal. What? The weak but insistent signal transmits on repeat in the Jernast system. Our science ship is pinpointing its sources emanating from within the mouth of a deepest stabilized subspace surface at the system's edge. Which could be on the other side? At the what system? The Jernast system? Okay. Journeyist. Well, where is that? Construction at? complete. Right there. <clears throat> Where's this go? Right there. That was no great shit. Oh, it's a separate system on the other side. 
Where's the system? Ooh, there. What's in that system? Research complete. Well, this is a fancy little system. It's got a Gaia world. Oh my gosh, these guys had some new stuff. Got their wormhole. Gas giant. Construction complete. Crowded world. Three stars. Nice. Okay. Well, son of a blankety blank. How's our uh, Dyson sphere working? Those are our Habs in our ring world. Where's our. What I, where was I building the Dyson sphere? I was building it in a ring. Bikun. Was. How are we doing? Keep building it, gentlemen. Keep building. Don't stop. Dang. Construction complete. Hmm. All of my goals being thwarted by the darn Federation. <laughs> darn Federation. Uh, now I see why people kind of eschew them a little bit. They're like, eh. Okay, so I made claims and they. So. <clears throat> Can we just. Revoke his association. Let's see. What's this say? We can invite them into our federation. Invite to revoke association status. We can revoke their association status with our federation. We must end our federation association. So how come I can't just leave the federation? The Golden Pact. File for its supremacy. Why can't I do that? Is it because these guys gave it? Let's see. Kick from Federation. Demand that leave Federation. So I can do this. Okay, I can leave the Federation. If you leave the Gold Pact, we may have to impose sanctions against you. Okay, that's fine. Now let's see how it is. The Versac don't like us. They're part of the Gold Pact. All right. Incoming transmission. Non the roof would decline. Break migration treaty. They broke their migration treaty with us and we found the Bioforge Masters with their blabbering energy intake. Oh yeah, whatever. Okay. So people are breaking their things now, and these guys don't like us, and that's fine. Who we're going after is the Rufari High Kingdom. So let's do that. Rufari High Kingdom. <coughs> Declare war. Conquer. Claim. I only want to. Their defenders are the Versac and the Bernathi Star Realm. We can invite attackers. Oh, but we don't have any. Declared war. The Bioforge Rufari War of Aggression began while you had fleets inside your new enemy's borders. A fleet has gone missing in action. Let's find out which one it was. Science ship. Okay. Second wave. Where are you? Yep, go right there. Third wave. Where are you? Yep, go right there. Where are the gate wardens at? This didn't go anywhere. Alright, everybody else just kind of hang tough for a second. This might be over really fast. Here we go. Okay, what do we have in this system? You, go grab this. Where are our transport fleets? Go there, please. I just 
want to conquer that system. I just want to claim it and be done. Okay, they don't have much for armies. Don't have much for armies. Let's hope that this goes really quickly then. Hostile fleet detected. It's a tiny, tiny fleet there. Hostile fleet detected. Okay. There you go, boys. You're right there. Go down there, land on this planet, and let's be done with it. Research complete. None of them are in my space. Research That's all complete. I care about. Planetary invasion begun. Hostile fleet detected. Planetary invasion successful. Okay, let's take a look. Rufari High Kingdom. <laughs> Settle for the status quo, and they're not quite there yet. Okay. In that case, here's what we're going to do. We're just going to go claim a few more of their systems then. Let's see. Hizzle. Hostile fleet detected. And I'll take this one down here. Oh, I don't have. I just got enough. There we go. We're gonna take that one. All right. And is there? There's a planet there. Let's go get that. Great. We'll have both those gateways wrapped up then. Hostile fleet detected. Hostile fleet We're at. detected. Where are they coming at? Right there. Heaven's Gate. I'm worried about that. As long as they're not on my side of the map anywhere. Let's grab this planet and then we'll see how amenable they are to. Uh... Almost there. Station under attack. The Sentry Spire and the Bioforge system is complete. Upgrade. Two dimensional trade decreases. Planetary invasion begun. Let's see. Tell us when it's done. Hostile fleet detected. Oh yeah, we're getting there. We brought 4,000 people. Rex, our com commissary, the subject of one of our enemies has entered into a war against us. Okay, I'm not worried about them. Either. Research complete. So give me this planet. Enemy planet secure. Now let's see what you think about that. Settle for the status quo. They're not quite there yet, are they? They're one point away. From being there. Got a ship up here. Okay, we finally got someone in our territory. Science ship lost. Be cool. You guys get up here. Research complete. I'm not giving up systems, but I do want the elegate. Mm. 
those two systems so I'm not gonna do sue for peace right now and get it get what we want I don't, I don't want to lose my two systems so Settle for the status quo. <coughs> All right. Let's see about that. There, we got what we wanted. Diplomatic grants, edicts. Take that. Okay. Cool. We now have the L gates. We now have the L gate system. All right. So what's it say? Elgate insights. These gateways have been. Yeah. So, what do we have to do to make the Elgate show back up? This is the Elgate. Endpoint opening the L cluster. Our scientists are now confident that our knowledge of the Elgates and the technology behind them is sufficient to abort their maintenance cycle. In it. If the attempt is successful, the Elgate in the Zorkin black hole system should allow immediate access to the distant L cluster. As the maintenance cycle ends, any additional L gates in the galaxy will likely also become operational within a matter of years as their self-correcting software readjusts. Still, this will give us a significant head start to explore the cluster without interference. Situation log prepare updated. Prepare the project. Yes, prepare the project and get all the ships over there. All right, track on map. Activate the L gate. It's just yeah, just the one place. Okay, so I need a science ship there. You. Research Get up here, complete. you can do it. Research the system. Right. What is this thing they have here? Okay. It's nice that you got that ship there. But I don't really care about that. Or this. What I want you to do is put... This is going to be the ship there. Can be um, of course this thing here give me a defense grid supercomputer and then give me all of these things and then start giving me defenses as well all right Diggity dog. <laughs> this is awesome. Cool bean arenas. Oh man, I'm excited. This is this has got me jacked. This is gonna be cool. So the crisis ended up not being a big deal because we were so well prepared for it. But the L gate is a different story. So let's get prepared for that. Let's get all of our all of our fleets up there for that deal. So where is the gate warden fleet? Okay, you're there. I want you over here. <laughs> I want all my fleets over here. I think this could be messy. Um, we're going to find out. So where are you? You're, how many fleets are here? Okay, we got four fleets right here.
four zombie sleeves. Give me... Just sell a little bit here. Let's find out how long this uh, science project is. Okay, the Grey Tempest. Our technicians managed to lift the lockdown from the Elgate near Zoricon Black Hole, but as soon as a permanent link was established in the L cluster, a massive incoming subspace surge was detected. We were able to restrict this potential invasion force from using our gate while still retaining access for our unit ourselves. Unfortunately, the incoming surge was diverted to the other Elgates in the galaxy. Strange vessels consisting of nanites are pouring through these now fully active gates, attacking everything in sight. All attempts to communicate with these machines have failed. In the wake of their passage through the L-Gates, we have detected a repeating subspace transmission emanating from the L-Gate. Buster, put it on screen. Mm -hmm. Decoding repeated automated subspace transmission, establishing translation matrix. Alert. Message is heavily corrupted. Access fragment one. We are the blah 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 architects of the Galactic Gateway Network. If you are receiving this transmission, then we can only blah us that we are not too late. Perhaps one of our message buoys somehow slipped past the blah 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 and escaped the cluster before it was closed off. Do not repeat. Do not restore access to the dormant gateway in our star cluster. <laughs> Under no circumstances must a stable connection be formed between this and the galaxy at large. For the sake of all civilization, our cluster has to remain under permanent quarantine. So it's the old uh, alien story. Well, by the time it gets decoded, you'll know if it's a warning, isn't it? In an act that will inevitably doom our civilization, we are deliberately isolating our home cluster to prevent the spread of the Nar Dishav, the Grey Tempest. These self-replicating nanomachines were instrumental in the construction of our gateway network, but when their blank had concluded, we found that they would no longer accept our commands. For a hidden back door, our blank managed to recall the machines to our home cluster, but this security hole has since been plugged. When they started harvesting our planets for materials, we knew it was only a matter of time before. The main blank facility is the key. All of their blank are routed through its subspace array, and without it they cannot function. Unfortunately, all our attempts to disable it have failed, and we can no longer muster the forces to mount another assault. If the quarantine of our cluster has failed, you must destroy this facility. As long as it remains, the Great Tempest will continue to surge unabated through the galaxy. We, we are truly sorry for unleashing this horror. In our hubris, we, mm. So we have to defeat this thing. And where are the other Elgate clusters? There's the cluster up here. Right there. Okay, and then what's this? This, oh, Great Tempest fleet right there. So what does their fleet look like? It's 26,000. So there's the Versac. All right. Well, folks, I'm going to end the video here. We're going to take on the Great Tempest next episode. This has been all very fun. So thanks for watching. I will see you guys next time. As always, if you like the content, please subscribe to the channel. If you dig the video, give it a thumbs up. And if you have a question or comment, drop down below. I'll see you next time.